Thanks so much for joining us. I'm Joe Butita. And hi, everybody. I'm Sherman Roger. Welcome to News Channel 3 on Midday. Uh, we're going to go to Rigetti High School first this afternoon, where students are back in class for the first time since fights broke out yesterday and the campus was put on lockdown. Natalie Tavidian is uh, in front of the school with an update, and she spoke to some parents this morning. Natalie, what's happening today? Joey, well, it's a very different feel on campus today. Uh, we're about an hour or so from lunchtime. That's when the fights broke out yesterday. Students are expected to see more security on campus. You can see a few law enforcement cars in the school's parking lot. The students are seeing more security on campus, and it's something that parents tell us that they're glad to see. Food on campus this morning? I just think it's going to be crazy. Um, everybody's going to be like... Uh cautious and like scared and classes going on as usual with added security well, they said the security day is going to be like high and like there's going to be more cops and more security around school today the classes were canceled after lunchtime yesterday this was the scene at Rigetti. investigators say six students four boys and two girls were taken into custody Students say there were four different fights when the school was put on lockdown for about two hours. <laughs> Cell phone video shows the deputy struggling with a few students. Investigators say the students resisted arrest and a friend surrounded the deputy. They say the deputy was pushed and hit. I've got kids here at Rigetti and then at Lakeview and they were both put on lockdown yesterday. As parents dropped off their kids this morning, these kids need to be reprimanded. They really do. Parents say this is a wake up call. There needs to be a message to all the students. As all of this was unfolding, some parents did tell us that they were worried because they weren't hearing from their uh, their students in, in the school. But I did speak with a few other parents today who said that they heard from the school right away and they were calm the whole time. Some good news, sheriff's deputies tell us that nobody was seriously injured. Live in Orchid, Natalie Tavidian, News Channel 3. Natalie, thank you for that. Breaking news on midday.